Good evening, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Arma with Stock Swish, and here today I'm reviewing BABA. I called this as an option trade today, very early this morning before the open, sent the letter out for the option letter, and, and, it, and, it, and it, it was a huge call. I'm just making call after call lately. Uh, I really do have, I have the golden Midas touch myself here. Uh, this is still higher. However, the earnings are next week. So the thing to do is to exit the trade before the earnings because you don't, you don't know what it's going to do <clears throat> after the earnings, although it could continue higher. So I called the 120 calls in an option trade on BABA this morning. It ran up into the strike, and, it, and obviously it still has several days left before the earnings, but I called the trade out for past that. It's just, you know, you got to get out of profit here, and today was a, oh, this is, get, this is moving up tonight. This is up in the aftermarket. I'm just seeing that now, 120.14. Yep, that's on its own. So this is doing its own thing. So BABA made a brand new all-time high today in the trading day, and it's higher, and it's, it's, it's higher. So it was a really, really nice call for people in the letter. And how do I do this? The, the, the ironic thing is I call this today, and I started teaching the bullish gap class today. Uh, the stock gapped up this morning, and I saw it. I don't even know the reason for the gap up. It doesn't matter. I saw the gap. I saw it would rally. I saw 120 was in sight. The closer you can get to the strike, the more beneficial it is for you. Obviously, sometimes you pay up for that. But the price of this was good. It was not crazy. And it did run up. It ran up all day. It power trended basically the whole day. And, you know, the market made new highs again today in the QQQs. So this worked. Where does it go tomorrow? We'll have to see. I can't tell until I see where it's actually gapping in the pre-market tomorrow morning. But tonight in the post-market, it is up. 709, it's up tonight. And it, it, and it got near that area, which it touched. I mean... It looks like if this market hadn't closed at 4 o'clock, which is when we closed, that it would have traded up higher. I mean, it looks like it just ran out of day. Look here. Actually, what was the close was actually right at 119.99. I mean, it touched 120, and then basically the market closed. <laughs> Poor thing. <laughs> so, you know, bottom line is you could still be in it. It's got time. But the earnings are next week. So you the best thing to do when you're up in this trade, which you're up in if you did it today, you could get in today, get out of today. You kind of get in it today, you could hold it until next week. You could have a nice big push run up. I have to see where it gaps tomorrow, but I see follow through in this for sure. Whether it happens tomorrow or takes one to two days, 122, 123, 125 dream target on this before the earnings, which is the 18th. I'll have to look and see if it's in the morning or the or the nighttime. Baba usually reports in the morning for for us so it's probably morning of the 18th but either way this should have a follow-through rally and even if you did it this morning in the call and get out today it was a really nice trade I mean to be able to take something to have it go right into the money is always the best thing to do so we'll keep watching we'll keep seeing we'll keep we'll keep seeing what ones we get and I will be watching this after the earnings as well to see if it gaps up, if it gaps down, if there's a call on it, if there's anything to do, if I can day trade it, if there's any options in it. I will look at that after it gaps, after the earnings. But for now, I called this this morning. It worked. I'm just on fire lately. I've got to stay focused. I've got to stay really serious. I have to just stay focused, focused, focused. Sometimes when you're calling a lot of good trades and and I absolutely am. You, you got to remind yourself every day, stay focused, stay focused, read the chart. Because sometimes you can, you can get all crazy and excited about the money and the trades. But I'm just going to stay focused here on what I'm doing and concentrate. So wonderful one here today in BABA. Good job, those of you that did it in the gap option letter. And we'll see what we get tomorrow. Have a great day, everyone.